in this video I'm going to show you how to design your t-shirt for Teespring using a free app called Rover. This is by GoDaddy. You can literally go to Google and search up for this app Rover app by GoDaddy and you can you know, find the website. So once you have found the website go ahead and create a new document something like this. Go here and click new project and that should take you to a page like this. On this page first let's go ahead and change the dimension. I recommend this dimension 4500 width by 5400. So once you have selected that then now let's go and find some inspiration. This time we are going to do motivational t-shirt and I found this design to be interesting. Let's right click and open it on a new tab. Just breathe. We have another one just breathe. Probably right now this makes sense to create designs uh, around this quote just breathe. Okay, so we have another one just breathe. We are basically going to use these t-shirts as an inspiration and create something similar as you can see here they are using some kind of flora and in this they are using a heart. And now let's go and find more ideas related to heart t-shirts. So we have more information. Okay, let's type that. Okay, looks like we have different heart along with some flora. Now there is a butterfly. So we know that we can use butterflies as well along with these codes. Just trying to get as much information as possible so that we can go ahead and create our t-shirt. Okay, this looks pretty good and uh, let's go ahead and get started. Here we have the same thing. Okay, now let's search for flora and let's see what comes up. Since we had a flora here, I'm just trying to get more ideas on flora. Okay, here we have some cactus. Alright. I think we have good amount of information right now. There is a leaf. Let's keep it open. So there is this flower. We have the heart. Both are having some kind of a, a script font. So that's fine. Here we have a butterfly. Okay, alright. Now go here and uh, okay this is the tree spring t-shirt okay that's something we are going to design now go to graphics here we are going to search up for something called flora let's see what comes up let me pick something which I find interesting probably let's take this one and let's search for some hearts like this heart then let's go below and see what else is there okay let's pick this one okay, for now let's move all these items out of the screen you can see all these are over here I'll explain in a moment like how you can put this together so basically I'm trying to create design and uh, trying to see what all we can bring into the plate let's type butterfly Okay, we have a butterfly here. This looks nice and this also looks good. Okay, let's take them out of this box. Okay, now let's try to create a design using this alone, this flower. Something like this, but in a different way. We're just going to use it as an inspiration. We are not going to copy the same thing. Okay, we have a different flower. Probably let's resize it a little bit and let's bring in the text box now here you can go and change the size let's add finder now let's change the text to just breathe we don't want any punctuation there let's change it to a different font go here and click browse fonts let's try and pick a script font probably let's pick this one man maybe I think we can increase the size a little bit let's increase a little bit okay and change the color let's pick a color from here probably this one this doesn't look very attractive let's pick another color so using this button you can pick a color from 
in anywhere on this page uh, i mean within this window probably this doesn't take from there within this window we can pick it let's go and pick this yellow i think this is fine so in all you have to do is compare it to the background uh, probably i think this would work well with this one so uh, let's see let's see how it goes once we are done just breathe for now just to make the text visible i'm going to pick a different color probably i'll pick this one for now okay so this is what we have let's see how this goes together probably i'll duplicate this one let's see if i can connect these two okay. then i think this is fine this and this let's see if i can group it i don't think there is an option to group but this is fine this looks good let's see if i can just curve this up a little bit probably i think i will remove this one just i'll keep it and pull it over here just and then now i'll copy and duplicate it and i'll type breathe and i'll just go this one alone like this a little bit and this one i'll curve it a little like this i think this is fine i think this looks good now rotate this a little bit Let's see how it how it looks I think this looks just fine. Okay, now let's go ahead and change the color. I'm going to pick the same yellow color and the same for this one as well. Let's go ahead and pick it. I think this looks good. Let's try it on a t-shirt. Let's try to center this a little bit. Okay, we have centered it horizontally. You just have to eyeball it. Yeah, we have centered it vertically. Now let's go ahead and export it. Just breathe, export. Okay, now let's go ahead and upload it to the design. Add an image. I think this looks good. This looks perfect. Let's try and add another color. Okay, I think we have one design ready. This doesn't look good on this one, I believe. Or probably should we keep it? I think someone who likes to keep it a little bit subtle, I think they might like it. Let's have that color as well. This looks too dark, but it's okay. Let's keep that as well. Probably I'll keep this as a default color. Okay. So I think we have successfully completed one design. I think this looks uh, more or less good when we compare it to these designs. So if you compare it, I think this looks pretty good as well. Just breathe. Here we have some nice flora going underneath the coat. That's how you create a Teespring design using the over app. You can create uh, many more designs. Uh, this is just an example. Uh, then uh, also you can create designs using other uh, you know images like this probably we can delete this one and delete this and probably this time we can try and pull this one inside and maybe i'll change the color like this just breathe let's see how we can do it probably i'll rotate this one let's see how it goes just breathe. Yeah, I think this looks fine now. Okay. I think this looks fine as well. Uh, probably this is a little bit 
bigger let's bring the size down uh, this should be a good size just breathe guys I think you got the point so you just have to play around with your design until you you know come up with something which looks nice and good probably I'll keep it like this only just breathe or should we just keep it like this just breathe so this can be another design which you can upload so all we are doing is taking inspiration from uh, what is currently there and as you can see there are around 26,000 sales so and this looks something quite similar we have some heart going over there and then uh, we have this color red which looks nice and bright let's export this one as well I maybe export to PNG probably let's assume this we have published the second design would be I'll go ahead and delete this and add a new image and for this I think light colors would suit much better so I'll remove these and probably I'll keep this one only because it doesn't look good on other colors so you create designs for your Teespring store using over app I hope you find this video useful if you like to see more uh, videos on uh, designing or creating designs for Teespring store then make sure to subscribe to this channel and also don't forget to hit the bell icon to be notified whenever I post videos like this thank you so much I'll see you in another video